this is from an excerpt from an up upcoming book that I plan on releasing about humor. It's called Chew Your Food, Darling. Chew Your Food. Being that I am a firm believer in the chew your food ideology, I am not a parent. In fact, I don't even like kids all that much, really. But that is not to say that this is to be a protein-induced snore of an article, as I by no means am implying that someone should go around just swallowing random people's truth as a means of sustenance in mind. That would be bullocks. The true reason I don't have kids is you, the parents. It's not bad enough that you rape your non-parent-speaking friends of good cultural conversationalism. It's that you then sit on top of them and spin your newfound religion of worship to the one good swimmer making it to the edge of the pool thing that makes us nutty. But what really blows us the most is the friction you create as you mount that moral white horse and gag us with the hypocrisy of it all. It gets to the point that we haven't been there last week when you were with that thing, not his father thing, and had to remind you to spit out what you were really acting out against that makes us cringe at how far up your own ass you've gotten. Your resulting reputation of hypocrisy is neither worth the rug burn of loss in what was real, nor the regret of what should have been a lifelong relationship and friendship in just would justify the burn of your actions in raising that which should not have been in the first place. It's that they are believing now that they can't measure up to you, only it's not you. It's not any really part of anything to do with you. It's not even you. What makes the strange state unbearable is that you then hit the street corners and spit out that BS of abstinence that goes too far. After all, even your newfound cult of moral majority can count back the number nine reasons for creating this new hypocritical world that I must then edge you off of the furthest corners of the world. So from all of us, to all the new faces of you, darling, shut up and just chew your food.